Hello, hi there. How is uh, how are everyone? How's everyone doing? Uh, I cannot talk. Um, okay, so just real quick, I'm going to go and invite some people. Um, now that we are live, um, it's been. Uh, I hope everyone had a really nice Mother's Day. Um, I had a very low key Mother's Day actually. Uh, we just ended up hanging out at home and. Um, Played with my son a little bit, uh, played with Dusty, played with, oh, cars and racing, and uh, did a lot of racing. Uh, it's kind of cool to know that my son would not trade me in for his cars, so I, I rank, I rank. I was pretty excited about that. I thought that was pretty cute. Um, but yeah, so we had um, uh, a low key. I actually have been having some headaches the last couple days and right now I actually have a massive headache. It's gotten a little better. I switched to my old glasses so I'm hoping that helps. Um, I do have a problem with my new glasses and they are getting fixed but it'll be about a week before I get the new lenses. And um, it's just my eye is, I actually it's like the headache is more behind my eye like I'm having a visual headache. So. So you'll have to bear with me. I had a card planned that I was going to have the sample ready to go and then I somehow managed to lose the dies. I dropped them. And uh, so now uh, <laughs> that uh, meant I didn't get my card done. So we are gonna actually finish the car, uh, card live here. And uh, hold on a second here. I'm um, going to invite friends now and uh, we're inviting, inviting, inviting. Um, going through the list, getting people invited. There we go, more people. And So there we are, I've invited some people, and you go ahead, please, I would um, love for you to share, and um, please, yeah, please definitely share, 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 and okay, so I shared that to my timeline, and then share to a page, I'm going to share it on my there okay so we're getting started here and I've got a cat that's decided to uh, lay on <laughs> my workspace here so she's gonna have to be evicted shortly um, I'll have to evict her and um, let's see here, inviting, oh I know, um, inviting a few other people here. And one more share, if I can figure it out. There you are, yes, share in a group my Sunny Girl Craft Forum. Here we are, okay, there we are. I am going to get going here. And okay, so my plan was to have a card all completed using the um, accented blooms. Here, I'll hold that up for you. The Accented Blooms, which is one of our new stamp sets that will be available June 1st. Um, I, I like this one a lot. I think it's pretty cool. And then I am um, also using the Cake Soiree, which this set is currently available and will be available in the new catalog. There's a bundle with it, but the bundle expires the end of this month. So if you want this set, oh, hold on here. If you would be like to have this set, now is the time to get it. Hello, hello everyone. Hey, hi Andrea, thanks for sharing. Hi Joe and Margaret, nice to have you join me. Um, so definitely want to, 
go with this one if you, now if you, it's something you'd be interested in. So let's see here. Let me just, um, okay, reminder, my May Hostess code, that's um, if you want to, if you would like to place an order, uh, and it's under 150, use that code. No problem, Andrea. Glad you could stop in. Um, I'll talk to you later. Uh, and then two, um, this is just a little reminder. If you place a $30 order, um, you'll actually receive a copy of today's project in the, or a copy, actually you'll receive today's a card, today's card in the mail, along with a written tutorial on how to make the card. And then if you place $75 order, you'll get today's card, a tutorial, and then a surprise package in the mail uh, come June, um, just after June 1st. I'm also in the process, I'm, I'm doing a um, paper share, so if you would like to um, participate in the paper share, I'll be posting details, um, planning to post uh, tonight or tomorrow at the very latest um, now. Um, now I've got everything pretty much figured out. I just have to put it together. So, and I've got the graphics started. So that's what I'm working on finishing. So hope you can join me. Oh, one other thing too. Um, the, uh, let me get that off there so you can see it. Um, the Share What You Love suite is still available through this month. And I have an awesome tutorial, 30 tutorials that you'll receive when you purchase any one of the um, bundles. So you wanna definitely check it out, um, it's worthwhile. So let's get going. So here we are, my kitty cat. She's modeling for you. Say hi, McCree, say hi. And now she must be evicted. Come on, sweetie. Oh, I know, you're such a kitty poo. I love you too. Mwah. Okay, down you go. You find a box. Oh. Did I put a box inside your box and you're not happy about that? Here, I'll move that box. Okay, now she's a happy kitty. <sighs> now we have happy kitty. Um, okay, so I started, I was going to finish this card and put it together and then, um, ugh, excuse me, I've got cat hair everywhere. And then I managed to drop my Big Shot platform with the dies. The dies went rolling everywhere and I lost my dies. So then I've spent the last hour and a half looking for all my dies. So yes, that was my afternoon. Um, and this is as far as I got. So um, this is all I have cut. And I do need to stamp a couple of more because I realized I did not stamp enough of um, the yellow. And I actually want the yellow and a small. So I'm going to just, here's all my stamps that I'm using. And um, the colors that I'm using in today's project are Granny Apple Green. So that's this green right here. It's a pretty green. It is very pretty. I think this is going to be um, definitely a favorite of mine. Especially when Lemon Lime Twist goes away. This is going to be a major favorite. And then I have the Pineapple Punch. And um, so here's Pineapple Punch. It's a nice, bright, fun yellow. And then I have Flirty Flamingo that I'm using. And here's the um, one that I've stamped already. The Flirty Flamingo. And then I have Gorgeous Grape. Now, I have never really been much of a purple person, honestly. But I am so in love with the new grape, the, the purple grape and then the heather that Stampin' Up! was introduced. I am absolutely in love with them. So decided I needed to use some grape today. So I am going to actually stamp first with the yellow, the pineapple punch, and remember to open the new stamp uh, inks. You just open it up kind of like a compact um, and then slide it in. And I'm going to, uh, okay, cat here everywhere. Oh, the hazards of living with a cat. So I'm just going to stamp a couple of these and I'm clean them off. Now we're going to do some of the flirty flamingo. I'm so excited this color is so actually not so much. Very excited, very happy this color is stain. Um, especially since they didn't bring back strawberry slush, so um, this one makes me happy. So there we go. 
got some more of those. And I do actually, you know what? I should have kept the yellow, the um, pineapple punch, because I wanted, yeah, okay. I wanted actually a couple of the large flowers. Now the cool thing is with the dies that go with this stamp set is that some of the dies are, there's two of the same image so you can easily die cut more than one at a time uh, which makes it so much easier to cut a bunch of them out at the same time. I really like that feature. And uh, you know what, I'm going to just do this real quick. I didn't do any of these. We might just do a couple. There we go. Because I really don't know how this is going to come together yet. I have a vision in my head of what I want to do. So, and I do need some more leaves, I think. Oh, I got some cat hair. And I'm going to have to clean my pad already. blown off. There we go. And again, clean that up. I opted just to use the one leaf. There's a couple of other leaf images and flower images too. But that's the one I'm going to stick with right now. That's what I'm going to stick with. Okay, so I am going to die cut these. Actually, I'll just even bring this over here. Hold on a second. So here's my big shot. We'll put it this way. And that that way. So then I can put all of these. So now here are the dies. So these are the dies right here. We got the sweet cake, which coordinates with the soiree, cake soiree stamp set. And then you'll notice it's got two of the smaller cakes. So I can cut out two of those right away. And then it has the two leaves, so I can cut out those right away. But it only has one of the larger, but that's okay. Because I'm not doing as many of those. So we'll line that up. And line that one up. I need to line it up here. There it goes. And there we are. And then, you know what? I'm going to flip this. I'd rather have it this way. I think they lay better. Yep, sticking to my finger. There we go. bumping the one. Okay, now I need eh, that one shifted. That one's going to shift. Hmm. Okay, I'm having troubles getting this down. Okay, hold on a second. Let's just, this one's just bowed too much. That one's not as bad. Maybe we'll go towards the center ones here. And I'm not lining it up. There it is. I think that looks 
pretty good. Okay, we got it that time. I think we did. I think we did pretty well that time. Sorry for the shake. Oh, I did have one of them shift. And that's why I cut more. That's why I skipped more than what I need. Just in case. Although I can actually probably. It's going to get hit in anyways. Okay, so. That one came out really well. And we're going to do. Another pink one, another yellow one, we're going to do I think I'm pretty good with that. We'll see what we have. I'm not going to cut those ones out right now. I'm going to pull off. Okay, so that's what I have there. Let's put these away so we don't lose them. Since I was having troubles earlier today losing them. Oh, I just don't want that. Okay, so then I have um, this set right here, the Accented Blooms, and I'm going to do the, I'm going to do the thank you. And actually, this one would be really good done um, on the big shot, on the Stamparatus, actually, I'm thinking, but I'm going to do it on here. I have room here. Although I don't know what color I want yet. I'm going to hold off on that. So I have my card front. And I do know that I was planning to basically kind of layer these around. This is kind of what I'm going for here. Wait, that one. We don't want that yellow. We want that yellow. So that's kind of what I was thinking of. Okay, so I think I know what I want to do. I want to use the... Um, I think I'm going to use the... Flirty Flamingo. So I'm going to just ink this up. A little off the edge. There we are. That turned out very nice. I really like this. And this would be a fun um, stamp to do uh, an emboss resist with, too. And I think Andrea is done now. My friend Andrea. Clean that up. I'm trying to get in the habit of cleaning my stamps pretty much right away. And then we have a punch. A nice punch that coordinates with this. And then we just punch it out.
There we are. So then, this is basically going to just go like that. Okay, so, I'm going to tuck those underneath a little bit more. And then we'll need to add in our, our, um, our leaves. Okay, so, where are my, of course I dimensional just about everything. So let's get the dimensionals on here. Come on. Then the other yellow one. So then you just kind of think about almost a triangle that you're making. I want that one just a little higher because I want that more on the end here. Kind of see the triangle that I'm making? Okay, nice. There we are. That works. Okay. So I'm just kind of stacking underneath here to make certain we, there we are. So they're nice and solid on there. Okay. We will have a pink one kind of peeking out there. Then we're going to do a leaf right there. We might do a leaf right there and have that pink one over there. Because I think a leaf right here. Just overlapping the yellow makes that pink pop. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. So now I'm going to find my snail. Put that there. It's all right to cover up the other flowers a little bit. I actually like that look. one on here. Just like that. And
you see my process a little bit of how I'm figuring out where I want my flowers, how I want my flowers. That one I'm going to just put there. And then I want this one up. Sit back here. And we remove the cat hair. There we go. Got that one on there. We need a couple of leaves over here. Just like that. dimensionals on these leaves. Hi Tyler, glad you could join me. We're working here putting together um, cake soiree. I had hoped to have a sample for everyone ahead of time but headache and then losing dyes it just went a little crazy, so that just did not happen. Um, I can actually honestly say right now that my headache seems to be going away, which makes me very happy. Um, the uh, Tylenol I took finally seems to be kicking in. I'm not certain if I care for that leaf, for the leaves there. Okay, we're not going to put those on. So then we can just layer that on. I like that there. Okay, so now I'm going to actually I want that in the center. And there's my kitty cat. She's decided to come back and join me. At least she's out of the way for the most part. Here we are. Okay, that didn't go on very well. And I might need to, yeah, I need to. I layer up on my dimensionals too to add a little bit more pop on things. No, actually, you know what? I just thought I had a thought. Do I want to do that or not? Should I add some silver thread? I'm thinking I should add some silver thread. Let's add some silver thread. There we go. So here's some silver thread before I get this attached completely. Oops. Put that off to the 
the side. There we go. so I know better where I and I really want that to stick up a bit there we are okay so now I do need just a few more leaves here right there Okay, so we have that, and now we need, oh, let's see here, where are they? You know what, let's use up my glitter enamel dots. And I'm going to actually go with the, um, hmm, that might work. I like the yellow ones. I like the green ones, too. Actually, I'm going to go with the green ones. A little bit of uh, here we are, a little bit bigger one. I'm gonna go up there. There we are. Now I just need to attach to my card front, and I didn't do a border on this one, just uh, the whisper white on the thick whisper white, and I will do dimensionals. And these are sticking. I need to get those off to the side. See that one down the center. Oop, cat hair. And I have more dimensionals here someplace. There we go. There you have it. I did it. <laughs> I made a card. Yay. Uh, based on how I was feeling earlier, I wasn't certain this was going to happen. So um, I am so glad that I actually, that it came together pretty much how I, how I envisioned it. Um, like I said, I really like the Accented Blooms stamp set, which is a new one available June 1st. And the Cake Soiree um, I just, I love the flowers that are in this, and then the fact that the dies come with um, a couple of extra dies, like the two leaves, two leaves here, the two for the same size um, flower there, so that's kind of neat to have with this, and um, here I'm going to just switch, so, so glad you could join me, I'm so glad my headache, it's still there a little bit, but it's definitely gotten better. So I was able to at least get this card finished, and um, I think it turned out pretty great. Um, it's a fun card, and uh, and I'm getting off the camera. There we are. We'll go this way. So then the the glitter enamel dots actually are retiring. Um, those retire, and if they haven't sold out, or I, ha I have to be honest, I haven't looked if they've sold out yet or not. Um, I don't think they have the last I looked, but it's been a couple of days. Then, of course, you know, we've got our new colors, um, the Pineapple Punch, our um, Gorgeous Grape right there that I used, and then the um, Granny Apple Green um, was the green that I used for the leaves. So there is what it turned out to be. I think that turned out really cute. Um, I just had the thought of, like, the bouquet of flowers and... All the you know all of the flowers with the thank you on top 
So I really love the way it turned out. Um, I'm glad you could join me. I hope you enjoyed it too. And let's see what else. Um, just a reminder. Um, oh, now I'm going to have to cough. The May Hostess code. Excuse me. <clears throat> so there's the May Hostess code. If you place an order with Pam Staples at SunnyGirlScraps.com and then just click on order 24-7. Uh, any orders under $150, remember to use the May Hostess code. And uh, then also to, let's see here, any other information here. Um, I am working towards the Greek cruise. I would love to take my husband on um, the cruise and that we could celebrate our 50th birthdays and especially celebrate his birthday on the cruise. Uh, he he um, teases me about never being around for his birthday because I usually am in Minnesota at the lake uh, since his birthday is in July. And then, let's see here, what else? Um, again, that's the reminder there. There's some, you will receive a couple, you know, some gifts. $30 or more, you'll receive um, today's card along with a quick written tutorial. And then if you place an order of $75 or more, you'll receive today's card. You'll, you'll get a, a completed card of today's card. You'll get the tutorial as long as a surprise package um, valid at about $7 coming to you in June. Um, and then of course too, if you purchase the um, any of the Share What You Love bundles, any one of them, and you'll receive this tutorial, a tutorial for its 30 tutorials um, total, you'll receive that as an email from me. And it's got some amazing, amazing tutorials, some really awesome cards in there that are super, super cute. And then on that note, um, uh, in crafting, there are no mistakes, just unique creations. Remember that, remember that. So when you are creating, have fun. Don't worry about it. If you screw up, you can. It's just not an opportunity to um, be creative. So we will talk to you later. Bye.